no doubt that the Penguins are gearing up for the playoffs where each goal scored can be the difference between a win or a loss. Well, let's just say that there's one house in Clintonville, PA, that is ready to celebrate each and every one of those Penguin goals in style. Everyone wants their man cave to be special. And when it comes to the Penguins, this fan is no different. Well, I'm a huge fan. Um, I've always been. My uncle took me to a game when I was eight years old, the first season the Penguins were in existence, and I've been hooked ever since. Over the years, Rick has acquired more than a few items that would be of interest to any diehard Pens fan. And for the last 20, he has not acted alone. In 1991, not only did we get married, but the Penguins won their first Stanley Cup. And when I look back at 1991, my marriage still ranks a close second to that Stanley Cup. You might want to get a shot at the couch. That's where I'll be sleeping when my wife sees it. <laughs> Bonnie probably joins in on the fun on game night. But even with all this, something was missing. Yes, I used to have a cheap replica light. And with all this stuff I have in here, when people would come over to my house to watch a game, I would have to manually light the light. And people would talk to me the next day. I can't believe you have a goal light. I can't believe you have a goal light. And I'm like, that's like a $10 goal light change when items at Mellon Arena went up for auction a few months ago. I wanted to limit it to the hat trick. I thought if I get a turnstile to enter my room through, seats to sit in, and the goal light to go off, that would be good enough for me because the more I look, the more I want it. For just over $300, Rick purchased one of 20 goal lights from Mellon Arena. He had a spot all picked out. It even operates by remote. So when the pen score, so does Rick. Come on, Kobe. I, I contacted someone from the auction who was nice enough to tell me that um, the way he cut it down, if I knew somebody that knew something about electricity, that they should be able to get it working. So I have a lot of good friends at work, and they were able to take care of me. And uh, so, yeah, that kind of put my mind at ease, especially the first time I lit it. It was just like, wow, this is special. Special is an understatement for this man cave. Yes, Rick has it all and more. I actually have extra light bulbs upstairs that I can't wait to come down and use. I'll be lighting them up in June. Well, Rick, we're waiting for you to hit that remote in the second period.